Daddy's back, you bitches! Malaywa! Daddy's Talk back, you me, bitches! Well, uh, Dave, oh, come on! Nero! Come on! Nico! What are you doing? Dave is not coming. Ah, ignore him! Come on, we gotta get this thing ready before we talk. Let's go. Here, pass me that. You ever been? No. Crazy place, Nico. <laughs> what you going to do? I might come back on board, or I might try to make a go of it. Like they say, it is the land of opportunity. I always wanted to make it big. On a nice place, get a dog, a house, live a dream. Like my cousin. Oh yeah? Yes, he's got the love. Cows, women, cars, parties. Uh, he writes me these wild emails, and after I got into trouble, I thought maybe uh, then I got this gig, and I spend the next seven months with you fine people, and I forget. <laughs> After the war finished, I couldn't get a job. Nobody could. Uh, so I uh, did some dumb things, got involved with some idiots. Ah, we all do dumb things. That's what makes us human. Could be. City. Fucking terrorists! What? Terrorists! There's been a big scare and you can't go across the bridges so good. We are passing the cab office, Nico. This is the business that will take us to the top of the pile. You 
with a divisa. I would stay in broker. Fuck it, stay in Hove Beach. Everyone like us does. Nico, you ever had two women at once? Four big titties to be playing with? Mrs. Samda, che umreti? Io tici your right, Chovice. Ne mogu de kaži, da imam. Cousin. This is the mansion? <laughs> Just a temporary place. The mansion is coming, cousin. That's the dream. Follow me. <laughs> come in, come in! Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. Uh, got him! <laughs> Little bastard. If he paid some rent, I wouldn't care. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's not nice. Oh, cousin. It's so good to see you. <laughs> <sighs> need to change anyway. <sighs> so! So. So. So, you full of crap or what? What? Uh, where's luxury condo? Where's sports car? Where's Barbara with big titties and Stephanie who sucks like a vacuum? What are you talking about? In your letters to my mother. In your letters to me. All I hear about is Mr. Big, Mr. Roman, living the American dream. Sports cars, condos, women, money, the beach. Opportunity. I come here and the only thing big about your life is the cockroaches. <laughs> That's right. I got the best cockroaches, I got the best pets. <laughs> Screw you, you idiot. <laughs> okay, I'm an idiot, but you must admit, I have the best line in bullshit you ever heard. Yeah, this I know, asshole. Look here. <sighs> All I needed was one good guy. One good guy I could do well. Not take over the world, but do okay. Now maybe I have this. But what about you? What about you, cousin? What? What about me? Well... Why you live home after all this time? First I hear you are running with the wrong kind, then I hear you join the Merchant Navy, now you're here! You never tell me anything! <laughs> no. What do you mean, no? No, I never tell you anything. Another time. Ooh, mystery man! Strange and exotic sailor! What happened? Did your captain make you pregnant? <laughs> Screw you! <laughs> no, no, it's nothing like that. The ships were fine. It was before that. Two things. You remember, during the war, we did some bad things. And bad things happened to us. <laughs> war is where the young and stupid are tricked by the old and bitter into killing each other. I was very young and very angry. Maybe that is no excuse. Roman? Roman! Ah! Are you sleeping, you fat no, fuck? No Come on! What's the time? Shit. I've got to get the cab back. It's on the shift. <laughs> ah! Oh, Jesus! Tastes Wrong. like a rat shot in it! Nico! Jeez. I've got to run. Uh, come well, meet me at the cab office. It's easy. Out about? the door, turn left, and the first I left at the diner, go down I'm one block and turn right on Iroquois. Then walk all the way down, and we're right there on the left on the corner of Cisco about, Street. Man. It's really flash. We've got lots of TDs and some incredible motors. Nico, give me a hug. Good to have you here, cousin. I've got something for you. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Uh, yes, Vlad. Uh, sorry. But forgive me, okay? No, no, please don't cut my cock off. Uh, okay, but... Yes. Uh, uh, okay.
Big guy, either do some work or get out of here. We don't need jokers. Screw you! Screw you! Baby, when I look into your eyes, it means something. I see little Romans, I see little Mallories, I see stars, I see angels. In my homeland, we have a saying. Yeah, we got one too. You're a fag. <laughs> Jesus, Roman, you fucking idiot. How can I take you seriously? Very difficult, I think. <laughs> Hello, Roman. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, <Miss. laughs> Mallory, this is my cousin I tell you about, Nico. Hi. Nico, this is Mallory, the beautiful girl I tell you about. See, not everything I tell you is bullshit. I bet most of it was. Hey. I hope you're less full of shit than your cousin over here. <laughs> Thank you. This is the woman that I'm going to marry. <laughs> Whatever you say. I thought you were going to marry me, <laughs> baby. Hey, bud. <laughs> Crazy! You're fucking crazy, man! You should lose few pounds. Otherwise, this beautiful lady is good to me. I know. I'm a fat prick. What can I do? Pay you uh, dance? I will, I will do, man. We spoke of this. No, we didn't speak. You spoke. Then you say your phone out of batteries. You treat me like a bitch. Never! I don't treat you like an idiot, not a bitch, huh? I guess it's true. The beautiful woman do like the guys with a funny sense of humor. Ho mm -hmm. <laughs> ho! I'm laughing. <laughs> I'll get you the money. I know. And Roman, tell this fucking yokel here if he doesn't stop staring at me, I'll have his head chopped off and put a film of it on the internet! Ouch. Ah. Oh, good. Great. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> Let's say what you like, but at least that guy knows how to speak to a lady. Yes, he's all charm. Come on, Nico, let's go. Uh, darling, I, I, I'll see you later. I've got to take my cousin around some more. Get him settled. Nico, you're driving us to a hardware store on Dillon Street. Doing some home improvements, Roman. You're going to build this mansion you tell me about? <laughs> oh, funny guy. We're going to get money. In America, you need money to do anything. You're taking me to a backroom game where I'll win all the dollars we need to really see this town. Nightclubs, women, titties! You can play, right? This is over. I am the best. I kick all the asses that play me. They call me the janitor. Because you can't pay your debts and they make you mop the floor? Never or what, no. Funny. No, I'm the janitor because I always clean up. I always win. Get it? Chistach, Naravno. I seriously hope your cards are better than your nicknames. Only problem is I'm playing with some money I meant to give to these Albanian scumbags. Here's hoping they don't show up, eh? <laughs> We got loan sharks after us. Roman, Stasse de Shava. Nico, wait for me here while I go inside to clean up. Shit, uh, I almost forgot. I'm giving you my old phone. My new number's in there. Call me if some Albanians show up in some shitty page willard. Those are the guys I owe money to. Do, do not hurt them. I know what you're like, Nico Pelic. You and your debts, Roman. Uve kisto nika drugacije. In denied coverage claims, it breaks my heart. There's just, there's just too many pills, man. It's making our immune systems weak. My mom was a, was a, was a visionary and a, and a helper. 
You know, and she left me in dirty diapers all day. And now I have a super goddamn immune system. I can lick the floor under a truck stop urinal. And it don't affect me a bit. And sometimes I do, for cash or whatever. Yeah. That's the problem. Let's stop blaming the HMOs because you can't see a doctor. Don't blame Profits or Nixon because you've got bad coverage. Bottom line, don't blame me because you... It's so quiet out here, Roman. You winning? Molinte red sida. Don't worry, I'm getting so many bullets, it's like I'm an egg cat. It's so cool. If everyone was able to see a doctor and didn't have to fill out reams of paperwork before they were denied a life-saving surgery because it cost money, it would be anarchy. There'd be lines for bread and we'd all be speaking Russian or Cuban and people would die. People are already dying because of paperwork and lack of coverage and their failure to understand the small print. <laughs> okay, Lennon, I understand. And this must be the loan sharks. Come on, that piece of shit is our money here. I want access. I want buzzwords. I want dreams. I want the Cousin, to look you two guys are going in the store. I think they are the loan sharks you speak of. Shit, I'm down. You better get out of there. All right, all right, I'm coming. That dream is America. Shit, Nico, it's them. They must have been told I was here. Well, Bellic, we will find you soon. Please don't hurt the men after us, cousin. They hate me enough as it is. Cheat and say, dinner's over, baby. Go buy your own pair of tits. There's a great word, a German word, a powerful word. word. Get us back to the depot, quick! Do you think they saw me? Of course they saw you. I mean, you're a distinctive man, Roman. That is why the ladies love me. Fuck those Shylocks, they'll get their money. They just have to wait. We should stand up to them. Gideti e ponos. Nico, you're new. You don't understand the way things work. Oh, yeah? We are at the bottom of the ladder, man. These thugs push us around, but they are not to be feared. It is the Russian mobsters, Vlad's bosses that run everything. Be careful of them. You tell me to behave, Mr. Janitor? If you understand it all, where is the money? I lost it this time, but when I go back, the last thing they will expect is for me to take everything. Then I really will clean up. Povere vatshu, kad vidim, Roman. We're here. Oh, you like your phone? Maybe one day you get a premium quality one like mine. Then you will have really made it. I can only wish. See you later, cousin. Fascinating. People come to me and they say, I don't feel so good. I tell them, well, save your eliminations for a week and bring them in a box. I can tell you what's wrong in a second. Now, this pharmaceutical lady is really nice with her little bubble tits and will make a fine receptacle for my DNA juice. And that's the only reason people listen to her. But listen, you don't need a pill for everything and barely for anything. Okay, uh, Mason brings up a good point. Thank this you. brings us to the topic of pre-existing conditions. Should you be denied insurance if you have one? Come on, Daddy, what's your problem? I don't have problem. You do. Don't be a dick, man. Come on. Where's your Russian friend now, huh? Eh? He's not my friend. He's eh? my love shark. Eh? Stop this. Eh? What are you? Who are you? 
Get out of here. What? Yes. Oh. What about you? Help me. Help me. Come on, Supak. Help me. Get out of here now. And if you come back, I'll kill you. You understand? You forgot this? You have been in bricks? Stronger. Shit, Nico. What did you do? He was going to stab me. Now he's going to kill you. Fuck him. Look at this mess. Screwed. Again. You want to know why I'm not <sighs> living in a nice condo, banging for women? It's because of shit like this. Assholes threatening Shut me. Shut up. Oh, great. Melody. Hey, beautiful. <laughs> Uh, yeah, great! Uh, listen, I, I'm having a bit of a problem at the office. Um, I can do it. Nico can do it. Huh? And what? Well, why would you want me then? Well, screw you then! Great girl. Can you do me a favor? Mallory needs a lift. Uh, can you go pick her up at the Hog Beach subway station? Yeah. Take the cab! She's got a friend with her. Maybe someone you can date. Fuck you. Oh, man, look at this crap. My computer and everything. You will meet him online. You should join an online dating service. Sleep with many men. Therein lies a prince. Why his life will be marred by failure. Oh, that's horrible. How can you tell? That's all we've got time for, dearie. What? No, no, no. You're oh, no. Good luck. What the hell? Get in, ladies. Hey, Nico. Thanks for coming. I should have known Roman would find some excuse not to turn up. This is Michelle. Hi. How are you? My place is over on Mohawk Avenue. How are you finding America, Nico? Not exactly what I expected. Nico, you know what? You need someone to show you a good time. Michelle, how about you? Mallory, stop it! Come on, you guys. You're both single. You're adults. Take a number, Nico. Hey, I'd like to see you again, Nico. You look like that kind of guy I want to get to know. You look like you just jumped off the boat, Nico. Handsome man like you should get some new threats. I think he looks fine the way he is. I don't think he even changed out of those things on the journey. How are you going to impress a classy girl like Michelle? I'm easily impressed. I know you are, sweetie. <laughs> and I just don't get it. Do you understand? Probably not. Thanks for the lift, Nico. Yeah, thanks. Give me a call sometime. See you soon, Michelle. The guys. There's three of them, isn't there? Well, hello. No. Hello. There's about 11 of them. I knew it. Cousin, I dropped the girls off. The friend gave me her number, but I don't think Mallory likes my clothes so much. I know just the place for you. It's on Mohawk in Hall. Go and get something a bit more 21st century. Don't bring science into it. Doubters doubt everything. Personally, I'd rather know. Which would you rather be? It is Bob, isn't it? No! Get that thing out of it! Exactly. That was a trick question. You were named after Saint Bob. No! I was named after my uncle who died. Uncle Mike. I'm talking to him right now. Mike. He's visiting from the spirit world. He was a saint. He's telling me he's very proud of you. He's saying you're a great and powerful man, only you don't know.
you shave, yes? I was a swan. Let me guess. Of course, it's not real. Guess. Hey, Roman. I got some clothes. It looks like they brought the stuff in from the old country, though. We must take what we get. When the big money rolls in, then we will look real classy. Anyway, you have Michelle. Classy girl for your arm. You should definitely keep dating her. But I'm not looking at simplistic, superficial astrology. Anyone can do that. I'm looking deeper into the cosmos. Hey, Michelle, it's Nico, Roman's cousin. Oh, hi. How's it going? Good. Now, I was wondering if you uh, wanted to go out with me sometime. You know, on a date. Yeah, sure. That could be fun. Yeah, I'd like to get to know you, Nico. Why don't you come over to my place whenever? See you soon. Example of liberal parenting. Your parents raised you in a commune. Yes, it was very disappointing. My parents were weak and feeble people. I don't miss them. I put myself up for adoption after they got divorced. I play a divorced dad in my new movie. It's got a talking car and a flesh-eating disease that threatens mankind, but <laughs> I've got great abs in it. It's a real character piece. Okay, uh, so Zach, uh, you've been educated in a public school. Well, sort of. I learned to despise the common herd in a public school. So then I learned about the world by being home. Hey, the leader has me cornered in the court, under the L train and Firefly. What does he want? Oh, I can't think what he could possibly want, or why he'd be pissed off. Can you? I... <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's be reasonable. Because uh, I'm real popular now. Okay, now, now, Zach, tell us about the plan to end hunger. Well. Hey, it's Nico. Hey, I'm just finishing my hair. Come in. Thank you. I'll be with you in a minute. Did you just move in? No. Why? All your stuff is new. Some even still have tags on. Oh, well, 